Are there any other areas of applied innovations in the healthcare space you find really interesting? I mean, I recently read a report that said 80% of the world's data has been created in the last two years alone. Even if that's directionally right, it's absolutely amazing to think about all of this data being used, you at Benevolent AI being able to analyze and crunch all of this. What are the other areas of applied AI that we should really be thinking through here? I'm, I'm interested in, in some areas outside of that, that healthcare space uh, because healthcare or, or kind of science in, in, in general is the approach that they take, the scientific method, is kind of pervasive across so many different industries. Uh, and, and I like the ability to learn how to do something in one area of science and then apply it to another area of science. So uh, I think one of the areas that, that we're inspired by at the moment at, at Benevolent is looking at, at ener energy storage solutions, so battery type technology, uh, where we can increase the, the kind of the, the energy density. You know, so if, if I look at the automotive industry, they've done a lot to, you know, to kind of get your car from zero to 60 and a half a second or whatever, whatever it turns out yeah. to be. It doesn't need to be any more dense in a car. But if you want to take, you know, an aircraft uh, off the ground and keep it aloft, it requires far more energy density than current technology has. Uh, and within the automobile industry, where, which has driven a lot of the innovation in, in energy storage technology, they're now looking at, at other areas. They're looking at recharge times and that sort of thing. So they're not looking at having something that gets you, you know, zero to 60 in, you know, 0.25 seconds. Uh, uh, but um, it's going to require a lot of in innovation that happens in those industries. Uh, and much of what we've learned in, in healthcare and our ability to ingest all this information, connect all this in information to itself, uh, and then begin to extrapolate as to what should be known can can be applied and is being applied within our group into other areas of science like energy 